weight loss products. They often make big claims. One company, Roca Labs, says its products sold nationwide can serve as an alternative to gastric bypass surgery. I'm type 1 insulin dependent diabetic, so watching my weight is very important. Because so Jennifer Shivey of Springfield, Illinois, was sold on Roca Labs because she could not afford surgery. I paid $580 roughly almost $600. Almost $600, far less than the thousands of dollars for surgery. The company's website advertises you can lose 100 pounds in 12 months, but Shivey said she ended up disappointed. It, it was supposed to be a powder that you mix with water and you, you drink it, but when you get it and you mix it with water, it congeals. It's almost like Play-Doh, and you're supposed to be able to drink it, but you can't. The company has a no return or refund policy, but Shivey asked for a refund anyway. They told me that they wouldn't give me my money back, that it's not part of their agreement to give money back. So I filed a complaint with the Better Business Bureau. And that's when this story takes a turn. After Shivey contacted the Better Business Bureau, the company filed a lawsuit against her for thousands of dollars, claiming breach of contract defamation after she posted the complaint online. Shivey says the Florida company even sent someone to when her Illinois outside, home. The, they blindsided me. That they had a process server outside of my house at 7 in the morning. Court documents show other consumers are named in the same lawsuit. Shortly after the case was transferred to federal court, the company dropped the lawsuit. Roca Labs used what the Federal Trade Commission refers to as an unusual clause, a gag clause. The FTC says consumers unknowingly agreed to it when they purchased the product. Buried in this uh, terms and conditions document was a restriction on negative comment. The Federal Trade Commission recently filed this lawsuit against Roca Labs, calling the clause unfair. The terms and conditions mean customers will not speak, publish, print, review, blog, or otherwise write negatively about Roca Labs. And if the agreement is breached, the company threatens to sue consumers to protect its reputation. Because it's depriving consumers of information they need to be able to make an informed purchase decision. Court documents show the FTC is aware of Roca Labs suing at least four customers. The lawsuit against Roca Labs also alleges the company paid customers who shared success stories. The company did not respond to our request for comment, but court documents filed on behalf of Roca Labs denies deceptive weight loss claims and argues there's no legal requirement to disclose customers are paid for positive reviews. It admits in order for customers to buy the product at a discount, customers had to agree to not disparage Roca Labs, but denies using any clause that harms the public in any way. I should be able to post negative feedback. Consumers should be able to find negative feedback.